In this clip that we just watched, does Miss Krzyzewski provide some reason that Lynn Hernan was drinking Visine with vodka? Uh, just uh, wanted to mix it again. Why? Because it didn't, it didn't taste like anything. The vodka didn't taste like anything. She wanted to put it in there. Okay. At, during this clip, does Miss Kurczewski talk about how Miss Hernan said the Visine made her feel? Kind of like numb, kind of her whole body. Is that different from a symptom that Miss Krzyzewski told you about in the last interview that would happen when Miss Hernan would drink Visine? Yes. And what was that symptom? That she would, uh, quote, shit all over. And again, in this clip, what does Miss Krzyzewski say is a, a result of Miss Hernan drinking Visine? That it would make her numb and drowsy. <clears throat> Going to slide four. I knew. She, my mom knows very well that Lynn did not want to be here anymore. She knows that. She'll tell anybody that because she does honestly know that. She knows what Lynn was like for 20 plus years and what she was like at the end. If you're struggling so much, why aren't you telling anyone what's going on? If you're struggling internally with Lynn trying to kill herself, um, taking this Visine, which you know is wrong, not normal, yeah. um, especially if she tries to drink a whole bottle in front of you, <laughs> right? The gun thing, everything. But you don't seem to tell anyone what's going on. No. Do you know what I did? I drank. I drank it away. That's what I did. You got to. It seems odd that you don't ask your mother or Scott for some assistance. Not, not even assistance going there with you, but just, well, Scott, Ma, what should I do? I didn't know some of it. Scott, know? what should I do? She and my mom got to the point where she didn't want to be around it. What do you think Scott would have said if you would have said, hey, let's drink advice and what should I do? He would have said, probably call the cops immediately. Because Scott does the right thing. Yeah. Did you, and if you know that, that's the reason you didn't tell Because you knew it was wrong. I knew it was wrong, but at the same sense, there's only so much you can do. And I, I just feel like I, I don't know. I didn't know what to do anymore. You said earlier. I, I love her to death, and I I didn't want to watch her anymore being miserable, but I didn't want to let go of her at the same time. I went both ways. Were you ways. with her the night before the death? Yeah. Because you said earlier, about six minutes ago, that you knew she drank a bottle the night before. Yeah. She drank, I, not a bottle, but she put it in her vodka. I did know that. I said that yesterday. And then you go there the next day, and she's yeah. fine. Yeah. I mean, she was in and out, you know, sleeping awake, sleeping awake. But, but, yeah. but she said, yeah, I'll see you later, darling, yeah. or something. When I left, she said, I'll see you later. She, seemed she knew she, I was coming back. And she she didn't seem in distress? No. Not, not any more than she ever did. No. She's not having diarrhea or she's not throwing up? No. Not. No. Okay. He thinks you killed her for the money. I swear to God. I it sure it tends to look like that on I know. paper. And I get when, it. when we meet with the DA, he goes I'm telling you, do you honest to God, when I talked to you guys last night, I felt so much better. I could tell. Because I actually honestly told you guys and I finally just gave up. And you weren't even in the room. I broke down with him. Well, I saw I watched it. Because I couldn't I couldn't I couldn't handle it anymore. And I, I'm telling you, I did not give it to her to kill her. Need, I, and well, I did well, not put it well, in. Why did her. you give it to her then? I gave it to her because she seemed to think it was a good idea. She didn't think she was gonna die from it though, I don't think either, because she was doing it for too long. It wasn't it wasn't making her in that sense I didn't think Did she was. Did you give it to her that morning? I swear to God I didn't. I gave her water. That's all I gave her. And I said, she always put it in. Swear to God, the three days that I was there before when I threw out a bunch of Izine, that's when she put it in water and the the trash from three days prior. Yeah. And if she's disposing them, where would she throw her stuff out? Would she throw it out in the bathroom? You said there were bottles in the bathroom, right? Yeah. Um, no, she had a garbage can next to her and the one in the kitchen. And she would get up and walk to the kitchen. She was up in the kitchen up till two days before that she physically was on her own in the kitchen. Because she would not dump the visine in the stuff while I was there, ever. Ever. But she knew she did it the day before. No, I, before. I knew she did it because I found all the visines. 
Well, she, that was her thing. She mixed them. I knew the night she before. Them. No. You said the night before you knew she put it in. No, the not the night before, though. She didn't put it in. She put it in when I threw out all the Visine bottles. When I threw out her garbage, so it was three all days prior. Yes. Yep. And I said, where'd all the Visines go? And she's like, oh, don't worry about it. And I'm like, what do you mean, don't worry about it? What'd you put them in? Because that's what she was doing for months. The only time she drank the straight from the bottle was the first time. The only time. And ever since then, she put it in her water or her vodka. She said the water didn't taste like anything, and the vodka, she liked it because she got, like, a little more of a buzz off of it. Mm -hmm. And that morning, the night before, did she have vodka? The night before she did. How much did she have, you know? It was a cup probably, like, this big. And she had so one in her cup. Hand. I mean, you're, you're, you're a bar girl. No, she had the smaller. She used the smaller cups for uh, her vodka. How many ounces do you think, maybe? Four um, ounces? It's probably, like, a cup about many? this size up to here. So, so ten maybe. ounces? Sure. And, you, and she had one and a half of those. So she had 20 ounces of vodka. Yep. And when was the last time you saw her? When I left that day. What time? This is the night before we're talking, yeah. right? I don't know for sure. I really don't Was not, it at 6 o'clock or 10 o'clock? I don't, I don't want to say because I don't want to be wrong with my time. I'm asking approximately, do you think? Dinner time? I'm going to guess maybe 5 or 6. So around dinner time? Yeah. The night before. It might have been early. I mean, I we were watching TV. Well, because you guys can look at my phone and know the times. I don't want to lie about times when I honestly don't remember. I got you. I know I was there. We watched on TV. What did you do the night before her death, remember? That was what we did. What did you do? You looked, oh. you looked at five or six. You and Scott went out. You went, watched the movie. You went to the kids' softball game. Something like that. I don't. You went to Chuck E. Cheese. I, I don't know. probably just at home. It was a Monday night. And Monday nights, the bar is closed that we go to. So we were probably just home. Was it a Monday night? I don't even know. She died on Tuesday. Okay. I remember that plane is dead. Um, but you weren't there like at 10 o'clock in this time? No. No. You'd be home before? Yeah. Um, I mean, I've been there late like that. But the day before, no. you would remember if you were there at 10 o'clock? Because you would have told the deputies, no. I was, last time I saw her was at 10 no. o'clock. No. Why? Well, I was lying. I mean, no. Because they usually ask you what, what the last 24 hours no. of when you saw her. And she drank two... One and, one and a half. One and a half. One and a half. So, so 15 ounces of vodka then? Yep. And when I left, I dumped it out and she said, give me water. And so. usually I always brought her two waters that she put by her. Okay. And the waters were sealed when you gave it to her? As far as I, I mean. You wouldn't roll. Because when you pick up a bottle of water, you no. can tell it's been open. Well, no. But the thing is that she knew I kept throwing them out on her. Because I was getting frustrated. Because every time I saw, because I didn't even drink the bottles of water the last month. I didn't trust it because I knew what she was doing. And sometimes she'd say, oh, did you get that from the right or the left? Or, you know, and I'm like, so I just didn't, I didn't trust it. Okay. I usually went out there with my own sample. You said you, you three days before, mm -hmm. you threw out the trash or a yep. bunch of in it. Yep. I threw out all her water bottles. There was from a that ton time, of did you purchase any more Visine for her from that time to the time she found her dead? I don't think so. I don't think so. What, what, when I say visine, what kind of visine are you buying? Do you know, does she have a specific brand she, she liked? Did, she liked a certain kind for her eyes um, that she actually put in her eyes. Okay. Um, what kind did she like to drink? She really didn't have a preference. So what kind would you buy? Cause Whatever. You just usually buy the same one. That's kind of what people do historically. Yeah. You go to the same I gas station, she you she know, the Whatever same. was cheap, to be honest. I, you okay. know, I didn't... I didn't sit there and pick up, but her eyes, she liked a very expensive, and it was a good one for your eyes, because I actually used it a few times when I had a chance. Because Visine comes yeah. in that like, weird bottle, and it's kind of a weird yeah. shape. Um, is that what you were buying, do you think? Are you buying off-brands? Honestly, I, they were just whatever. But what kind did she want? What was the kind she really liked for her eyes? For the eyes, it was um, tear eyes, tree size, something, something T eyes. It was like And what did the bottle look like? White bottle with blue on it. And I think it was like tea eyes or tree size or something. Would she drink that one ever? I don't, I don't know for sure on that. I don't think so. She really liked it for her eyes. But I don't know for sure. Is she telling you what kind of eyes for, no, for her drinking? No. When I first did it, the first time I went, I bought all the regular. She just said, can you get me some more eye drops for my eyes? That was the first time I ever bought eye drops. Or bought her multiple, you know, more. 
And because uh, she, on a regular basis, went through probably six boxes of the regular ones for her eyes. So the first one I went, they were all eye, regular eye drops for her eyes. And that's the one where she undid it and literally squeezed it into her mouth. And that was the first one. Did you ever see her use the $13 bottle stuff that's, for her drinks? Oh, no. I, I've never, except the first time she drank it, I've never seen her do it since. But you're buying, you're the one providing Yeah. So you know what you're buying. Yeah. So you're buying the $13 bottles, mm -hmm. and she's using that for her eyes, and mm -hmm. then you're buying other kinds yep. that she thinks she's ingesting. Yeah. She so, honestly never Is she going through a lot of the 13 her. bottles, the $13 bottles, or is she going more through the little bottles? The more through the other ones. But I never, except for watching her drink it the one time, I never, ever watched her do anything with it. Um, one time... She took it and, like, put drops of it in her um, her glass of vodka. And that was the only two times that I saw her physically do anything. I would come back and the bottles would be empty. But you know she's using it. Yeah. Because she's going through bottles yeah. and bottles. So if we get back to my original question, yeah. three, three days before you throw it in the trash, yeah. a lot of bottles in the trash. Yeah. How, how many bottles did you buy that last week, do you think? Maybe 8 to 12. Do you remember where you bought them? Offhand, no. Because I just bought them wherever. And you bought the cheap or ones or the expensive ones? Both. Because when she died, there was still one or two boxes in her bathroom of the good eye ones. And I think one was open. And I thought it was next to her, but maybe it was on the kitchen sink or maybe it was, I don't know. The one she actually used for her eyes. And you remember it being there when you found her dead? No, I don't. I don't. Okay, you don't. That's yeah. clarifying. I don't remember where, because I think he said that we didn't see it. I don't know where it was around her or if it was in the, sometimes some of the stuff was on the kitchen counter. I don't remember. I, honestly, I don't. I'm being plain. I get you. And I, I, when I ask questions, it's because when you say something, yeah. it comes out a certain way because your brain, <laughs> it's your life. So I want to make sure that we're clear that on the same page. So I'm not saying you're lying. Yeah. I just want to make sure that you and I are 100% on the yeah. same page. Does it say, is that my report? Yes. Does it say what stores I went to out there? No. He's going to ask him. No. Yeah. But I do have a question. Yes. So during their follow-up question with, uh, with you that night, yeah. they asked you, do you think Lynn was suicidal or wanted to die? Mm -hmm. You said yes and no. I know she loves her cats and always worried about them, but she was tired of being sick and tired of not being able to get around as she used to. At what point do you tell the deputies that she was suicidal? That not too long before this, she held a gun to her head. She bought a gun off my phone and put it together. I mean, she's dead, so don't worry. <clears throat>